Hi everybody, I'm Steve-O. And I'm Nick. And we're here playing Boom Beach today. We're going to critique our last operation for our uh, task force, Sudden Impact. Now we're going to click right over here. And we click this uh, button right here, the top left. It's going to show our last operation was the full Monty. I'm not sure if any of you have ever done the full Monty, but uh, if you haven't, it, uh, it's definitely worth trying. All right, we're going to click here to the top, and we're going to go all the way down to the bottom. And first, we're going to critique coal. All right, we're going to view the battle. We're going to do it in a pace here. So we're going to go twice the speed. Looks like coal has chose to uh, some missiles right on that uh, rocket launcher, which is good, but he's going right up the middle. Bad, bad choice. Bad choice to go up the middle. He should have went right up the left side, not even the right side. Dropping those missiles was good, but go left side next time. Do not go right up the middle. All right. Next, who do we have here? We have me, which is actually not me. It's just a guy by the name of me. And let's see me's attack. Your name is Bloatware. All right. Bloatware. Okay, let's see here. What he's chose to do, we're gonna do a little faster motion. Don't do the flurries on that, that's a waste. Total waste. He's gone for the uh, power stones and the mortar over here. What are power stones? Power stones are these green things right here that glow. And when you kill them, they give you energy for your gunboat, which he should be dropping gunboat energy on all of this, these defensive buildings here, especially the rocket launchers and the boom cannons. But he's choosing to take out these and waste his gunboat energy. Never waste your gunboat energy on power stones. Total waste. Especially when it's out of reach from uh, the rest. Let's see what he's going to do over here. Oh no, another waste! That flurry could have just went on some more rocket launchers. Total waste. Total he waste. He should have used them on the defenses. He should have used them on the defenses. Absolutely right. If you're going to attack the power stones, use that needed, needed gunboat energy. Alright, it's all over. For defensive buildings otherwise someone else could have done that all right next who do we have here this uh real naigu okay very good very good i'm sure i'm not pronouncing that correctly all right good strategy here a little bit better than me's I don't know if I would go right up this side here. I'd try and stay out of reach. Yeah, that's uh, what I would do. Let's see here. Nice. He's going with the uh, bazookas and the heavies, the hookah combination. I think he's going to get one of these buildings. Yep. Nice job. Okay. This guy, this is, this is better for our team than the last attack. All right. Duke. Nuke M. Some high expectations of Duke. Let's see. Nuke M. Nuke M. Let's see if he's going to deliver on some high expectations. Flurry of missiles. Very nice. Right at the rocket launchers. Another flurry of missiles. Very nice at the rocket launchers. Where's he going to drop his troops? Dropping the troops. Doing the hookah. Put down an EMP. Very nice. Getting close. Forget Nuke M. Put down a heal, it's another being, heal. His name should be Nuke Flurry. Yeah, he's done good, though. That definitely helped the team out on uh, taking out this base. SBD. All right, why, SBD. Why is his name SBD? I don't know. But I hope none of you have SBDs. Just kidding. Um, let's see here. Flurry of missiles. Good job, good job. Let's take out those rocket launchers. Good job. Another bomb there. And, why are people choosing to go that way? Oh, let's see. He's got the bazooka heavy and a tank there. He did some damage. Nice little help there. Did he do better than the last guy? Bad. I don't know. Baker. Baker. Baker, Baker, come in. I'm going to ask him to bake me a cake. You think so? Yeah. All right, here. Speed up a little bit. Dropping some bombs. Oh, good. Heavies. That guy did something oh, good. Yeah, he might do okay. He might, oh, yep, yeah, he's doing okay. All right. Sir. And as you can see, the other uh, players softening up these uh, targets has really helped out. This strategy is not bad. He's getting in close, so this rocket launcher can't uh, attack him. 
Then if he gets in close to the mortar won't be able to attack him either, but you can see that shock cannon is just tearing him up there. Wait, if you get close to a cannon or a mortar, they won't be able to attack you? Uh, certain uh, defensive buildings, yes. Uh, and this shot cannon is just tearing him up. All right, but great job. Great job there. I think he did better than that. All guys. right, Jace Ponko. Let's give it a try. Let's see what you got. Jace versus Lotwear. All right. Ready, fight. Oh, good job. Good job. So we got at least one building. You're going to drop your troops. Come on, go drop your troops. Oh, he dropped them over there. Good oh, choice. he's dropping them. Okay, let's take it faster speed. Let's see these guys run. Run, Forrest, run. Okay, he's got the hookahs and going. Remember, people, you only have a limited time to destroy that's, everything. That's right. There's that timer up top. Two minutes. Less than two. So Time's just attack over there. Right. Can you just attack over there, please? Yeah, he's taking the power stones. Please Not... don't be stupid like that one guy. All right, taking out the power stones. Oh, that's a good idea. Power stone. There we go. All right, good job. Good job, Jace. Let's see, we're on sloth. All right, flurry of missiles. Where's all the power stones? Power stones are gone. Oh, does it save the province of the other guys? Uh huh. It That's sure does. Pretty cool. It is pretty cool. All right, we've got some bombs coming in to take out that shock launcher. This is a great strategy here by Sloth. Zoom out. Is he gonna? Oh, he's got his troops coming in. Let's run with those troops. Run. Oh no, the military. Okay. Did you see what he did there? He dropped some smoke. That way, uh, smoke the uh, when you drop smoke, then the defensive buildings can't attack you. He's already taken out a couple buildings. Good job. He's trying to get close, but no cigar there. But he did do a lot of damage, especially that shock uh, launcher, which did. is going to help out a lot. So now we're going to go to Rez. Let's see how Rez does. Got some high hopes for Rez here. All right. Rez is attacking tension. Look it. Are those boom cannons? Those are boom cannons over there. All right. Now, Rez is going heavies and bazookas and some medics. Okay. Good strategy here. Okay. She just EMP. All right. EMP again. Troops aren't really getting touched. Got the heavies taking a tiny bit of damage. A little more EMP there. Good job. Flurry of bombs. All right, is Rez going to take out more of these uh, boom cannons? All right, it's doing good, doing good. The bazookas are tearing it up. We're we going to get that last one. Oh, nice job, nice job. And you can see the medics coming up here to heal the lone survivor. Take this up a notch, a little faster on the game, Mr. Lone Survivor. Right, he's going for a power stone. I think I'm sure Rez is just hoping down. for uh, some energy here. Right. Oh, one more, one more. Let's see, where's he going? Oh, and they're gone. All right, good job, Rez. That made a significant impact on tension there. All right, Steve-O, let's see how this battle goes. All right. What are you going to do? What are you going to do when they come for you? Let's see. He must be thinking. Must be thinking. Must still be thinking. All right, finally dropped his troops. Hopefully he's got a good strategy here. Taking his troops. Got a flare over there. Another flare. You must be trying to avoid something. Some bombs. What's he going to drop? All right. These rocket launchers are going to tear him up. Oh, shot cannon up there. Nice. Slowed down. EMP on the rocket launchers a couple of times. And all right. He might have this. Ooh, nice job. Nice job. 
All right. And tanning. Let's see, he's dropping his troops over here. Oops. He's going to take it. If they have, ooh, shot cannon. Take a little damage from that flamethrower. The bazookas are going to have the flamethrower here. Excellent. Are we going to be out of range? Let's see. Is he going to be out of range? He is. He's going to take out these flamethrowers here. Remember, bazookas always outrange the flamethrowers. And is he outrange of everything else? There's a cannon over here. He's out range of everything else. Let's take it up a notch, speed it up. He might just take this base if uh, time doesn't run out first. This is a lot of bazookas pounding on this base. What do you think, Nick? Does he have it? I don't know. Oh! Boom! Good job. Very good job, Tanning. All right. That is the Sudden Impact Task Force just reviewing the last Full Monty attack. Great job, team. And uh, hope to see you on next one.